I have absolutely no airflow and it's hot. So air is supposed to go through the return, up through the blower motor, into this fire area stuff and cool off with the evaporative coil. So I'm gonna take it apart and see what's happening. My filter's clean, so it's something else. So here I am taking some tape off. Got one, two, that's supposed to have one, but it doesn't. There's one, that's supposed to have one, but it doesn't. So I'm going to very gently take the cover off and let's see what the hell's inside. Ugh. That is absolute sludge. Let's vacuum it. Oh my god, it's thick. So my coil was freezing and then thawing. And then freezing and thawing. And freezing and thawing. And let's move that sucker out of the way. Oh my gosh, I've been in there for 10 years. Oh, I'm so glad you released me. But I'm gonna get out of here. That was weird, but okay. Look at that, it's so thick. It literally looks like felt. And it is so dirty. That's so dirty. Look, it's completely coating everything. There is, I can't even see coil. Let's remove this sucker. Okay, so this may look like I'm being a little bit rough with it. Uh, this is a fast forwarded version. Um, I am being so gentle, it is insane. Those little fins can move so easily and bend so easily that I would not want to create any more restriction. So it, I am being very careful, very gently pulling this out even though it looks like I'm being super rough. This is about um, twice the speed. So what the hell is that, gum? A baloney wrapper? Oh man. That's so satisfying though. Be gentle, be gentle. Keep in mind the fins go up and down from the top of the A-frame to the bottom. They're not going horizontal, they are vertical. Um, so I cannot run my fingers like across it. Uh, it's up and down only really. Um, so I'm scratching up and down. Oh my gosh, there's the whole corner. And I do apologize for the camera going, you know, wonky all one-handed and I'm not left-handed I am now time for that money shot Ooh, it's getting stuck right there Thank you. 
you, ghost, for helping my shot. I don't know what happened there. But okay. This, let's remove that sucker. Let's see how much crap was in there. Here it goes. And... It's a boy! Oh my god. That is so thick. It's probably a good, I don't know, half inch. Nope, that's too big. Maybe a third. No joke. And it goes up to six liters. That's a two gallon bucket. That's a gallon and a half. It's a sweater! Okay, let's get the show back on the road. Thanks, Alice. That was weird. Time to get back to work. Okay, that's what we're dealing with after removing the felt. Uh, you can kind of see it. So I'm going to vacuum what I can. And then I vacuum out the condensate line because, yeah, that's had a lot to work with. So we're going to brush it. This is a soft, like, plasticky brush. It's not wire. And we're going to start from the top. Again, um, I'm starting from the top of the A-frame going down in most things. And this is really awkward to use. I'm not really able to get in. I'm basically just kind of side brushing the the tops. Um, it doesn't feel like it's really getting in anywhere, even when I'm able to, you know, get bigger areas. We're going to give that a go. And I'm already able to get into the coil, so that's already better. So I'm going to go ahead and brush the top. And now I'm going to brush the inside. Oh my god. And it just keeps getting impacted. I have to keep clearing it off. I mean, it was bad. Bad, bad. Very gentle with this tool. You don't want to be bending anything. very corrosive. I have a spray bottle that I can put that shit in. Damn, that's a pretty color. Um, which is this one, a spray bottle. So I just spray it from here. Mm, seems kind of far. I really want to get in the things. So I'm going to go get a, two garden sprayers. I'm hoping a garden sprayer will handle that shit. And then water, because then I have to rinse the shit off. And I don't have a hose that doesn't have just a loose end because shit gets stuck to it and we just cut the end off. So I don't wanna make a huge water mess. 
because of that, because it's on top of that. And it's still in this shit. And bleh. So I gotta run to Walmart. Hopefully I will find a fucking thing that I can stick this in and then I can just go pump, 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 spray. You know, down there. Ugh, I feel gross even just sticking my hand in there. Um, all right, so to Walmart. On my way to the store. Bop, bop, bop. Just kidding, I'm in my driveway. Look at me, I'm driving. I'm driving to Walmart. This is a staged thing. Because I already went to Walmart. No, just kidding. Ha! Okay, so I got that water sprayer and two little small bottles. I'm gonna put the that inside the bottle and we'll see if we're able to get in there. All right, so I'm spraying. I already hate this bottle. It super sucks. It's slipping out of my hand and this shit is like oily. I can feel it on my glove. Okay, so the top looks okay. I can already start seeing that it is going to foam up, which I did not anticipate. Look at that, it's foaming up pretty well. And I did spray it mostly on the outside so it can drip in. And then I did a little bit on the inside. Fuck it, let's rinse it. Wow, look, you can see that like stuff really did help. Wow, it's just coming right off. And let's see what it does on the inside. It's just dripping off. I do have to vacuum the condensate pan, the drip pan. I'm not vacuuming off any of the chemicals, but I do vacuum in the condensate pan because this is water and I'm not trying to flood my house. Oh my gosh, look at all that crap. See, I'm vacuuming inside. I was kind of getting the edge bottom of the pan because this is sitting inside a pan with a hole in the middle so that it goes inside the furnace. So just trying to keep it clean. This is the coil after I cleaned it. Ugh. It's all calcium and just impaction. Oh my gosh. This is going to take a lot. That is already rinsed. That's the side that I rinsed. And look, you can still see it's very foamy. That garden sprayer. I was using mist. I eventually wise up and used the massive sprayer part. It's nighttime and I've been working on it. Um, so I tried that solution and I rinsed it, rinsed it, um, but that shit is just not coming out. So I'm gonna use a different product. I'm really hoping there's not like a chemical reaction. Pray it's safe. Doesn't say use, don't use with other shit. So I'm gonna try this one. And even though it says it's no rinse, I'm still gonna rinse it because I'm hoping maybe it's really good. It has really excellent reviews on Amazon so and YouTube. So I just want air conditioning. All right, we're gonna get this to go. Shake it up, spray the fuck out of it, and then let it sit. And then um, hopefully it's magic. Hopefully it's magic. Be magic. Please be magic. Make sure that you get everywhere. It has a very direct stream as you can see and then when I don't push it enough it's kind of more wide um, but that stuff was great to getting right inside the fins I loved it for that it was really hard to get right here on the bottom part and 
the top was the hardest part, I would say. The inside was really easy to spray, and I sprayed the shit out of everything. Foamy, that stuff is really got into the fins. I used three cans of this shit. Okay, so I've cleaned this thing three times and now I'm gonna brush it. I've got cleaner. I'm dirty. Here is the finished product. The white parts that you see are bent fins. I'm not sure how that happened, um, but I did take my fingernail and bend them back to the best of my ability when I was done. Um, but it looks great, and I can see right through it, and I'm so impressed with myself. I worked hard. There's none of that caked on shit. Let's test it with light because I saw you're supposed to do this. And look, I can see through the entire thing. I did it! So, cut this in half so that I'm able to get that panel off because that was a bitch. Um, just know you can move this entire A-frame out. It can move out like a whole six inches. So when you are trying to take this fucking panel off and put it back on, keep that in mind that you can move it. Just keep in aware of your where your condensate line is. If Now to get this part in, I can do it. In here, ah, nope. Damn it. Okay, fuck it, manhandled it. That's as good as that she's gonna get. I can't even get a screw in that one. And I can put one in there. Alright, we'll put one in there. Can I put one in there? I don't think I can put one in there. I thought, did you take it out? I don't know, fuck it. And there she is, in all her glory. I just have to put that damn pipe back. Hope you guys enjoyed this. I'm gonna go take a shower. Bye! And no, I did not scrape off any of that fucking rust that you saw on the back of that panel.